whole blackmailing trick? I refuse to believe it's true. Nothing can be proved until we actually see the letter. We can't possibly do that until the morning because the bank's shut. Do you believe that? Yes, I'm afraid I do. Did you realize what would happen if that letter got in the press? Realize the full implication of this ghastly situation. The letter might be a forgery, but we can't tell until the handwriting is identified. Even if it's a forgery, my whole reputation would be ruined forever if the papers get a hold of this. We must see to it that they don't. It's a nightmare. If it is true that Father didn't paint the pictures, it stands to reason that someone else did. The first thing to do is find out who. Try ringing out the nearest asylum. <laughs> do be quiet, Colin. That's a very sensible suggestion. Whoever picked a portrait of Marjorie must be mad as a hatter. Oh, Colin, you are helpful. <laughs> I think it would be more helpful if you could continue to amuse your wife in the library. We're quite comfortable here, thanks. Do you think Sebastian knows who painted the pictures? I know he swore he didn't, but he could have been lying. Maybe he did it himself. <laughs> Whoever painted those pictures had genius. And that is my considered opinion. Not only my opinion, it's the verdict of all the finest art critics in the civilized world. Do art critics really know? Well, of course they do. Most of them are men of the highest integrity. <laughs> I've often heard you refer to them as sycophantic sheep. Well, you're only on the rare occasions when their opinions run contrary to my own. Oh, dear. Could be. It's probably the press. Oh. Ready for Sebastian. I'm surprised he isn't here by now. He generally has his ear thumb for the keyhole. I'll deal with this. Mm. This is Mr. Sorin's studio. Can I help you? 